But I just had guns drawn for taking money off my own account. Tonight, growing outrage as newly released video shows famed director Ryan Coogler being handcuffed in January after he was wrongly assumed to be a bank robber. Hey, sir. Hey, man. Come here, favor, man. Come this way. Oh, yeah, man, back. The standout filmmaker in town for production of Black Panther's sequel visibly shocked and confused when Atlanta police suddenly approached him and drew their guns. What's going on, my man? Trying to put money on my own. Kugler had been trying to take out over $10,000, according to the police report, passing a withdrawal slip to a teller with a note written on the back to be discreet when handing him the cash. The Bank of America staffer, who police label a pregnant black female, told officers her computer flagged it as a high-risk transaction and that she was alarmed by the note provided here by TMZ. And every time I ask him like a question, he's like, look at the note. She called 911 despite Kugler presenting his debit card and ID. So I said, do you have your ID? He did give me his ID. It was a California ID, but my stomach started turning. Like, I'm like, okay, it just seems odd because you were making a withdrawal, but you hand me a note on the back of a deposit slip and you keep telling me, look at the note, but you don't want to talk to me. So I'm like already like, okay, like, you just acting really kind of, it's just weird. Kugler, along with two people waiting for him in the parking lot, briefly detained. He explained to police he was trying to avoid drawing attention when requesting such a large sum of money for his safety. I don't write down on a note how much I went out, and then I don't want it ran through the money counter right there at the desk. The whole bank ends up looking at me. Tonight, social media erupting in frustration. A tweet from Bernice King reading, I just don't think so many understand or are even trying to understand the trauma he was subjected to. Others pointing out how his directorial debut, Fruitvale Station, depicts a law enforcement incident that left a man dead. Bank of America says it deeply regrets that this incident occurred. It never should have happened, and we have apologized to Mr. Kugler. Police, too, calling the incident a mistake by Bank of America, acknowledging Mr. Kugler was never in the wrong. Officers uncuffing the Wakanda legend roughly 15 minutes after talking with him. Because of the seriousness of the call, we don't just come out, and unfortunately, in a situation like that, you don't get the benefit of the doubt. We detain, and then we ask questions later. And Emily Ikeda joins us now in studio. Emily, what is Ryan Coogler saying about all this? Well, you could see in that body camera video, he was visibly shaken. He says this should have never happened, but the Bank of America did address it to his satisfaction, adding, quote, we have moved on. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.